big guns. The guns. Yeah, they can. Yeah. Yeah. They yeah. Cannot. yeah. yeah it is going to be gun people, so I'm not sure how secure. It just made me any secure to have somebody with guns that's going to shoot at the other people with guns, and they're going to shoot back. Yeah. Exactly. No, you're joking. About the no, really, it's going to be an es it's going to be a escort. security. It's going to be a security escort. Security. security. How do you security without guns? Well, what, <laughs> one thing is uh, that uh, you eliminate like uh, bandits. Uh, so By they, having they, the guns. They wouldn't. Uh, yeah, if it's uh, rebels, then yeah. Then. Rebels are different than bandits. Yeah. Because bandits will just go the they, other they way. Want, yeah, they want to steal the car, and they're not going to steal yes. a car if they're going to have to fight for it. Whereas rebels, rebels, will they, fight they, for they it. want to. Well, they want to fight the enemy. Right. Enemy. Although security is not necessarily the enemy, right? Because they're a humanitarian security, or now we're no, going not, with the no, military. They're not, yeah, they're. I would so much more prefer to a con, a go convoy. with a convoy of humanitarians. Not going to happen. Okay. Because we have courage we are for being courageous. here. That's what yeah. the security yeah. told us. We are courageous <laughs> to be here at this time. Just what we needed to hear. I know, I was like, thanks. It's very cold. And do they have enough blankets and clothes for the children? Halin tuko batenia hanakun to the natfal o kabutul main tuko. They do not have anything. They want to turn back to Sudan. Hmm. They don't want to stay here. This country is uh, very, very. It's the situation of this country is very difficult, so they want to. They, they don't want to stay anymore. They just to turn back. The, the first refugees moved from Sudan to the Chad. This is first their village. Oh, okay. so they are from the, the first. The very first village. Yeah. Where the Janjuit attacks the first time, that was their village. And they are the first refugees coming to wow. Sudan. So that, uh, it was very, very difficult. Even uh, the, uh, the helicopter are bombarding from, you know, and down the ginger wheat. So it was very difficult. She said at this time uh, they didn't also think to, to take their didn't think to take their their cloth and any or blanket because they didn't run they ran away no donkey nothing everybody ran away in different direction uh, once when she came to to Tini she find uh, some of her children <gasps> and uh, till now till now till now she doesn't know where are the other family and they don't know are they uh, they are died or they're not died she don't know where are they till now uh, around 10% uh, that she are missing yeah she can't go like this she want that uh, the person that brought her here have to make peace in Sudan with the president of Sudan if there is peace they turn back but now, like this, if she turn back there, Omar Bashir will kill her. That's her message. Does she know why Bashir wants to kill them? 
انت ما لا انت الناس اللي عمر بشير بسولك بسولك مشاكل ده She said that we, we are women and children, we don't know uh, the, you know, the problem. Money for the food? Yeah, when they are, when they are in the kindergarten. Yay, yeah, beautiful. Yay. Shukran, Jazile. Good job. I